Wait, mananalangin tayo ngayon sa ating family. Joshua 24.15 Choose this day whom you will serve. But for me and my household, we will serve the Lord. Right now, we are going to pray for our family because they need our prayers. Yes, some of them, hindi strong ang faith nila sa Panginoon. Hindi nila alam paano magkaroon, paano mag-start ng relationship with God. And some of them, hindi pa nila na-encounter ang Panginoong Jesus and never surrender their life to Jesus. And even though na nag-share ka na, nag invite at ka na, at ginagawa mo na yung lahat, for them to get to know the Lord. But the best thing that we can do right now is to pray for them. Not just today, but every day of our life. Dahil sino ang mananalangin sa kanila? Tayo mismo as their family members. So right now, we are going to pray because the desire of the Lord na hindi lang tayo. Acts 16.31 Sabi doon, believe in the Lord Jesus Christ and you and your household will be saved. Bakit gagamitin tayo ng Panginoong Jesus nung naka-encounter tayo sa Kanya to win our family for Him? Because hindi lang kalooban ng Diyos na tayo lang ang ma-save, tayo lang ma-bless, tayo lang maka-experience ng peace na nararamdaman natin ngayon. But also our family. And you will be the the vessel of God's presence to them that they will see that Jesus Christ is the true living God and they will see your life shining like Jesus. So now let's pray for our family. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, we surrender our family members, each of them. You know them by name. At alam ko pa ngayon na mahal na mahal niyo po ang bawat isa po sa kanila. And you have great plans for their lives. And you are preparing a place for them in your kingdom. And as I pray that we will always fervently, increasingly praying for each and every one of them to encounter your love. To encounter you. That they will have this personal relationship with you. Uh, in a way na plano nyo, Panginoon, marami pong tools na pwede nyo pong gamitin at marami po kayong tao na pwede pong gamitin for them to to listen to the message, to hear, to take heed sa word ninyo. And I pray that they will encounter this extravagant love of God in the salvation of our Lord Jesus. Thank you, Lord, that I and my household will serve you. I and my household will be saved because we prayed and because of the work of what Jesus had done for us. Thank you, Lord. We give you back all the glory, honor, and praises. And in in our family members, kung may sakit po sila, I know that you are going to heal them. And I know, Father, that we will be an instrument of prayer to them, reaching out to them, at the sharing to them the good news and being a light to them. And I know nothing is impossible to you. Some of our family members may be suffering from financial. I pray, Father, that you are the one who will provide. And you are the God who will give peace to the family, Lord, who are in trouble. Thank you, Father. You are such a great and mighty God. And we surrender to your loving hands each and every prayer that we have right now. We love you. In Jesus' name, amen. God bless you. Have a nice day.